hour one, it's 1040. About 1140 ish now. It's 130. There's a tornado siren going off. It's about 3.30 now. It's 4.30, so I decided to stop for a bit of an early dinner slash late lunch at this beautiful, beautiful out over. It's 5.30, I've gone 18 miles. Now begins the night hike. About seven o'clock. It's 9.30 right now. 11.45 at night. I made it to Harper's Ferry. It's over there. It's like three o'clock in the morning, four in the morning. It's six o'clock in the morning. And I, for the next 24 hours, I am going to be attempting to hike 47 miles. Non-stop, I've gone about two and a half, 2.6 miles, 5.1 miles, about 7.1 miles so far, about 11.6 miles, about 16-ish mile, 21.5 miles, 26.5 miles, about 31-ish miles. Nothing beats midnight beef stroganoff. Well, 10 miles in total left, three miles left. Sun's coming up. I got one mile left. The four state challenge. Right down there is the Mason Dixon line. So it's called the four state challenge because you start here at the Mason Dixon line between Pennsylvania and Maryland, and you go all the way down here to like Harper's Ferry and a little bit up into Virginia, touching four states in 24 hours. I have now touched all four states. It's a great challenge. But there's one that I know I can complete, and it is an obstacle that I know I can overcome. I won't lie, it's sure to be very difficult. Oh, I'm so tired. My joints feel like bionicle limbs, like they're gonna pop off in a second. This is where I'd put my view if I had one. They really want me to cross that somehow. Made it. <laughs> I think a lot about why I hike. Partly it's the isolation. When I'm out there, I'm often alone with no one around for miles, and yet, weirdly, I find that very comforting. It's for the challenge. Knowing that I cross vast distances and climb tall mountains, all with only my two feet and whatever I can carry. Anything great experienced was accomplished by my two feet alone. I find myself repeating encouraging mantras and motivating messages constantly. We're so close. We're gonna get there. We're doing well, making good progress. Yeah, we still got this. We're so close. I think it's because at the end of the day, I'm the only one who can climb those peaks and hike all those miles. No one else will have these adventures for me. I'm the only one who can overcome my own personal adversity. And when the work is done, when the journey has been trekked, I can look back with pride, a feeling that can be hard to find in retrospect. You guys have always been there for me. Thank you. I made it to Keys Gap. 47.5 miles. And a little under 22 mi hours, I think. Oh boy, my feet hurt. I, I, I want to sleep. <laughs> made it.